Hello, fellow audio engineers and music producers. Two bits of news today. First of all, Acoustica's Steel Tube Emulation Plugin will be going off the intro sale at midnight tonight. So check it out. Get it while you still can. I have not tried it out thoroughly enough to give my opinion on it, but uh, it's worth checking out if you like tube saturation. The bigger news is that Aquarius, which is the installation manager for Acoustica Audio, has finally, at long last, been upgraded to version 3. And with it, the big change is GUI scaling. I no longer have to, you know, get super close to my monitor to be able to read this text. In fact, I can make it even a little bit bigger if I wanted to. You find that by clicking the gear icon or the cog wheel or whatever it's called, going to settings and then under the customize tab, change the GUI scaling to whatever you want. I'm, I'm actually kind of laughing that they have it at 50. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to click that because if I do, I, I might not be able to recover the software. But uh, I'll probably cha end up changing it to 150%. You can also hide trial products, hide the older products. Um, I'm not sure what that is. I'll have to keep going through this. But anyway, most of what you need is going to be in your settings menu. And let me cancel that for now. And then what you want to do is just, if you hit search, I should only have what I don't, well, no. What I haven't purchased and what I have either been purchased or got an NFR for. But look at that. Look how big the imagery is. Look how big the text is. This is fantastic. This is what I've been waiting for for years. So I'm excited to share the news with you guys. Um, you know what would be an interesting thing is if you could hide your purchase plugins so that any of the ones that you don't have um, would appear. <laughs> but let's check out the installed tab for right now. And I'm going to update. I think it's called Corn, right? That's, that's the newest update. So it's their hardware sampler emulation. Right now it's running slower than normal. All right, there you go. So they've been updating some older plugins recently. This is, uh, I believe, their newest plugin. And it got some kind of anti-aliasing. Oh, wait. That's right. I have the trial version installed. Um, well, anyway... Maybe, maybe now's the time to update it. But no, when I'm not recording, I'll update it. But yeah, you guys can check it all out. Again, I'm an Acoustica Audio Street Team member. And I will be using these in the upcoming Mixing with Only 5 Plugins video series. But wanted to show you guys this in case you are an Acoustica Audio customer or haven't ever heard of them. They use a different kind of programming to get the results for their products. Basically what they do is they dynamically sample different hardware and then that then becomes the product. Now there's a lot more involved than just that. Like they do error correction, they do noise reduction. So basically you're getting the sound of hardware without the negatives of hardware like noise, like the electric bill, I was going to say electricity bill, um, like the cost to maintain it, you know. So all the positives with very few of the negatives. Here's another one that I'm going to, um, what do you call it, buy. Purple is the Pultec. Now I have smoke, wherever that is. I have smoke, but not purple. And I think... Poltec is such a, a crucial plugin that I, I really need to send my hard-earned money over to over to Italy. <laughs> so um, anyway, in fact, there's there's a freebie. So there's you know Acoustic has freebie plugins. They have 30-day free trials that can then be extended sometimes. 
You know, they got reverbs, they have delays, they have obviously equalizers, compressors, um, saturation, all, all kinds of things. And I've been one of their biggest cheerleaders since the beginning because back when I heard about Nebula a long time ago, um, which was their precursor to the Aqua series, they, um, it was good stuff, but it was just complicated to use. It used up a lot of CPU, especially back in the year 2007 and 2008. And, um, you know, it was in its infancy back then, but now, you know, ironically, you can have a lower powered computer running these newer Aqua plugins. And so, you know, maybe one day I'll, maybe before the, uh, what's it called, Black Friday sales are over with, I'll go through and tell you my favorite ones, but that's going to be for a later video, but I'm just skimming through these so you can see some of these. This is a Fairchild 670 compressor clone. Um, let's see. Opal is the, oh boy, John Orem compressor, and they also have an equalizer. Salt is the, Salt's one of my favorites. API, Neve, and SSL all on one plugin. And, I mean, they just have so many unique plugins and ones that are, you know, other companies have released. But Acoustica, to me, is like the top tier plugin company, which is why I talk about them all the time. Because <laughs> uh, I want you guys to have the top tier stuff, if it's within your budget. Otherwise, I do talk about free plugins, um, which, again, Acoustica has some of those. You know, they, they do release freebie plugins. So, um, anyway, thank you all for watching.